Hello and welcome to the Michael Mission Vlogs. The Mr. Vlog Show. How you doing guys? Today I'm here to talk to you guys one on one about how to start your YouTube channel. Okay, so now um, first thing you want to, uh, step one. Now first thing I want to do, I want to talk to you guys straightforward. I don't want to use any kind of wipes or dissolves or anything like that. I don't want to use any cut to roll B or cut back to roll A, you know, some things like that. I want to use any kind of editing tricks right now. What I want to do right now, I'm just going to talk to you guys straight up. Okay, so now, um, first thing, before you decide to start a YouTube channel, what you want to do is you want to make sure you decide what it is you want to say. Not just in general for your whole entire channel, that's kind of crazy because I've been doing it for years and I still don't really want to know what I want to do for my whole entire channel, but just, you know, try to figure out what you want to say for that specific video, okay? So, um, so the thing is, is uh, I hear a lot of different things over the years I've been doing YouTube is that I've heard that, you know, you need to go ahead and make sure you make sure your videos are a certain length every time you speak. Now me, I um, I stuck with the five minutes per video. That would that kind of worked really well for me. I didn't get burnt out and I didn't, um, sometimes I went over because say if, uh, like I always took my camera with me wherever I went. Now, that's another thing I want to talk about. Uh, is your cameras, your cameras, cameras, cameras. Everyone thinks, oh, I can't start a YouTube channel. I spoke to a lot of friends who saw what I've been doing on YouTube. Now, I'm not a huge YouTuber. I'm a really, really small YouTuber, okay? Now, um, I tell my friends, after they see my videos, exactly what goes on in my videos and what I do and what mater uh, materials I use. And they're so shocked. They're like, oh, I can do that. And I'm like, well, why don't you try? You know, so things like that. So why don't I have the experience? Okay, so the thing is, is that, um, your equipment doesn't matter. Your equipment doesn't matter. That goes hand in hand with what you say and what you say it on. Okay, so your equipment does not matter. This is how you want to start a, um, a YouTube channel in 2021. What you want to do is uh, you want to make sure that you figure out what you want to say. And now if you skip over your words and stuff like that, don't worry about it. Just your first video, your first couple of videos are going to be horrible. Like I said, I've been doing YouTube for years and I'm still you can hear me I'm still kind of <laughs> don't worry about it it's okay if you get to the point and you understand what you're saying and you get your you communicate your point across to the audience then they're gonna come back and go oh this dude's kind of cool man he's crazy but you know he's cool you know so that's always awesome um I'm sitting here on the set of one of my one of my shows full tang got to <laughs> Gotta promote that. Okay, anyway, so my my very first video was uh, shot on Halloween years ago, okay? I had on a Halloween costume, and I'm sitting here like, oh, hey, guys, Malcolm Richmond here, how you doing? <laughs> you can barely hear what I was saying, which brings me to my next point. Speak clearly. Make sure they can hear what you're saying. Now, it may seem like I'm yelling right now. I'm not. I'm just projecting. I'm speaking from here, you know? That's those acting glasses coming through. <laughs> anyway, so... This is the phone that I used when I first started. I was on it. Oh, wow. This is the phone I was using. It's an old phone. It's like a like one of the first galaxies, man. This is the phone I use, and that's the phone I'm using right now. I'm not doing. I'm not using any kind of effects, uh, captions, or anything like that to you know seem like I'm like high class YouTuber. No, nothing like that. It's just my experience. This is all you need. Look, just to prove to you, I got a mirror here, and I'll show you what I'm using. Look, that's me right there. And that is the light I'm using. And that. Well, you do need a light, you know. Turn on the lights, man. <laughs> For real. Turn on the lights, okay? So you can see the lights. And my... Let me get a little closer. Ooh, sorry for that glare, guys. You can see that? There's my lights. My lights. And my phone. So I can see what I'm shooting. No, the thing about that is that the cameras that I use, a lot of the cameras that I use, like this camera right here cost me about $250. Not too bad because this camera actually costs, I got it from like a secondhand store. <laughs> it's a great camera. I don't use it because, because I can't, I can't see what I'm shooting. I love to look at myself when I'm shooting that way. If I'm sitting like this, I'm dark now. I'm sitting over here. I'm out of frame. If I'm like right here, you can't see the rest of my body, so you can't really see because I like to speak with my hands. Things like that. Just little stuff like that. Your first couple of videos are going to be kind of awful, but the thing is, is that 
<clears throat> they're gonna be yours and they're gonna be out there. So figure out what you wanna say and just do it. Just take that first step. That first step is watching this video and figure out how to start a video, how to start a YouTube channel in 2021. That is the first step. So you're interested, that's why you're here. Second thing is uh, get your phone and just, you know, click, put it on the tripod and speak away, you know, and there you go. And uh, if you guys have been watching any of my other videos, you'll see that I'm kind of crazy and I'm kind of bouncing around a lot. But uh, I've been buying cameras like all over. As you progress through your channel, as the time progresses, you'll buy other cameras. You'll find out that other cameras work for you. This is another nice camera. Really good. I like this camera a lot. I have another third camera right here, but I think I was fixing it because I dropped it like three times. And I'm not sure that bad boy doesn't work anymore. But, you know, whatever. So, um... What you want to do is, uh, when I first started, my first channel, I was all over the place, just doing everything, I going to going to martial arts schools, I was going to different video stores and gaming stores and things like that. Just whatever I did during my day, I took my camera with me and I just posted it. I made sure I did like at least five minutes a week, a week when I started off. I wasn't too serious in YouTube. I was just interested in it and I really wanted to do it. I know I had something to say and I don't want to share it. And then um, out of nowhere, people started, you know, sharing back. Like, hey, man, that's pretty cool. I was there before. And some people from my city, some people not from my city who was interested in where I was from and what I was doing and things like that. And another thing, you need a personality, guys. <laughs> I'm an introvert. I kind of am. It may seem like right now I'm not because when the camera on, I turn to Malcolm Richmond. When the camera's not on, I'm the same dude. You're just walking down the street and you don't notice, you know. Supporting my Black Panther shirt. Anyway, what's going on? And this is something I do. I'm sharing everything, guys. This is something I do. I write down everything I want to say. A little too much light. Let me kind of... Not too much light. Okay, so I write down everything I want to say. Uh, when I go into... Now, some YouTubers are so professional. They they just memorize all this stuff. And they're so cool. And it's like, okay, they memorize all this stuff. So they're pretty cool. So consistency, consistency, consistency. If you want to post every week... Pick a day. Like me, uh, I have another show. Like I said, I have a show called Full Tank. And what I do is I um, I shoot that show throughout the week because there's a lot of editing goes on in that in that show. And I use my laptop, and I used to have a big uh, desktop computer that just do so much awesome editing, and I lost it because it broke or something like that, or I virused out. I don't know. It was just a really old computer. And uh, unfortunately, I can't do Full Tank the way I want to, but... But using the materials that I have, like a laptop, you know, it takes a little bit longer to edit. Plus, I'm really lazy, so that doesn't help things either. <laughs> so anyway, the show is still out, and it's really awesome. And I just posted another episode, the second episode, yesterday. And so I make sure I post that episode every Monday, okay? I shoot it throughout the week, and I post, it's ready for post Monday. Now, vlogging, uh, just as long as you do it every week, just make sure you get enough videos on your channel because the more... The more videos you have, the more it spreads out over YouTube, okay? And YouTube will go, oh, okay, this person is starting to pick up. All right, now, all right. So let's, let's feature them on other people's pages. When people go to YouTube on their phone, they say, oh, who is this guy? And they'll click on it, and boom, that's how you get views. Views, views, views. Now, let's get into, okay, so consistency and want to get paid. You want to get paid? The thing is that getting paid will take a while. Now, I've been on YouTube for years, like I told you guys, and I have not gotten paid yet, okay? It's not about the pay for me. It's about, you know, I have a lot of friends who live in different countries and who live in my, uh, I got family members who live in different states, and they love my shows and they love my views. I mean, not my views, but they love my shows and they love seeing what I'm doing, what I'm up to. So the thing is, is that... Um, when I upload, I upload for them and I upload for me, you know, because I see I get new friends like, hey, I didn't know you had a YouTube channel, man. That's awesome. It's like, you do well, you know, I went to uh, Disney World last week. You want to check it out? Yeah, sure. Let me check it out. Okay. So they got the video and they all got to sit in my house and watch, you know, especially with the social distancing. It's a whole a great thing that people get to see what I'm doing. It's just, you'll figure it out. It's pretty awesome. So, um, um, let's see, uh, do what you love or you'll get burnt out. The thing is, now me, I do what I love, and I put it on YouTube. Like uh, I love, I love going out window shopping for things. Like I'm always window shopping for awesome things, like cameras, and I love technology. I love phones. I love cameras, and I love new tripods, and I love my lights and stuff like that. I love all kinds of things. So what I did was, um, I eventually came to this, this here, which is, again, 
full tang. You know what I'm saying? So I officially came to that full tang, and that is an awesome show for me. So um, let's move to another thing. YouTube changes how they pay their their content creators. That's you and me. Okay, so the thing is, is that when I first started YouTube, it used to just be get a bunch of views, they'll cut you a check. You know, and that was it. You know, that was it. That was how it was when I first started. I was like, wow, I need a bunch of views. I need a viral video. And I started getting paid. That's how it was. But now, now what they say, I'm not really sure that it really works because how it goes, I'm being very uh, upfront with you guys and honest with you guys. The thing is that they say you need 1,000 subscribers to be eligible to get paid. And you need 4,000 watched hours okay so this video right now is on going on on 11 minutes right now so the thing is, is that if this video was like just like 11 12 minutes long that's cool Does that mean like you know a couple thousand people have to watch it you know in order to you know get that hour mark hours not minutes hours mark okay so now over the, over all the years i've been doing youtube i only have 291 subscribers at this moment moment so i mean i have not been getting paid at all but uh, I have over eight thousand watched hours. So when I hit, when I when I get that seven hundred and nine, uh, seven hundred and nine subscribers more, then YouTube will have to start cutting that check when I start getting those views, you know. So, but that's not really why I'm here. Why I'm here is because I love doing this. I love talking to you, and it's been so inspiring. And um, to be a little bit more personal, I first got on YouTube. I always knew about YouTube. I always knew about YouTube. And um, like I said, I was an actor. And uh, when I would do like movies and projects and sitcoms and things like that, we would post them or indie sitcoms, not like NBC or ABC or anything like that. <laughs> just, just straight to the internet, you know, things like that. So um, um, that's the I always knew about YouTube. Like, oh, we're we gonna put it on YouTube when we're done. Like, oh, cool. Or we're gonna buy our own website and we're gonna feature it there. Like, oh, cool, cool, cool. That kind of thing. I always knew about that, you know. But I never thought about actually getting my own YouTube channel. But I got. Uh, hospitalized for a couple months and I lost my voice and I lost my confidence in doing anything martial arts anything anything that I love I just lost confidence so the thing is like what happened was um, they went ahead and they said well maybe you should practice talking you know I was like well or we'll practice speaking I was like well how can I practice speaking so that's when I started the the Malcolm Rich and Vlogs which is the Malcolm Rich Vlogs show I would just take the camera and be like okay I'm going to the store today guys and I'm going to buy some deodorant <laughs> it was that it was that cheesy and that corny. I still do videos like that every now and then, like when I'm going to like the Asian Plaza or anything where I think you would like to see. I would take my camera or my phone. Like I said, I take my phone out of my pocket and hit record and just start doing it. Guys, like I said, it's the 21st century. The thing is that it's so easy uh, to learn how to edit. And YouTube can teach you how to edit and teach you how to you know, post and do all those different things. Just go to YouTube and just type in how to do this, how to do that. Boom, you got some Yahoo who could be you teaching you how to do this. So it's that easy, guys. So there should be no excuse on not knowing how to start your own YouTube channel in 2021. There are different editing videos. There are screen share videos, you know, so you can do like clip videos, like, uh, like, uh, uh, what are those channels? Uh, family, funny as home videos, those kind of things, you know? They don't have to be all your videos. They can be like other people's videos. You can talk about them. Oh my God, that's so funny. You can turn on the TV. You can see all kinds of shows about uh, hosts who are making fun of YouTube videos or people who are falling on their butt or getting you know courageous on YouTube. Anything like that. Just The possibilities are endless, guys. So to wrap that up, all you need to do is hit that record button. That's all you need to do to start your YouTube channel. That's all you need to do. This whole... 14 minute uh, video was all about just hit the record button guys that's it and I uh, hopefully I can see you out there please comment and subscribe to this video or well, subscribe to my channel and comment on this video guys thank you very much I'll see you out there I'm Mark Richmond and I'm out and hit that record button remember no editing <laughs>